We begin this show with postseason basketball and one of the more surprising results of the day. Rugby taking on Velva for the District 11 championship for the fifth straight year. We go to second quarter. Velva up 18 to 8. Aggies Olivia Passa taking the pass, draining a three. Velva looking fantastic. But rugby trying to come back. Mikkel Hildebaugh takes the defensive rebound coast to coast and hits the pull up jumper. But it's Velva that pulls off the upset. They win District 11, 42 36. The District 12, the championship with Mohal Lanesford Sherwood taking on our Redeemers. First quarter action Mavericks Janie Sovkol takes the pass and laying it in. But then the night, Maya Vibeto with an answer, driving and hitting the step back jumper. Nice shot there, but the Mavericks had this whole game under control, winning by 13 and the District 12 title. Staying in District 12, some do-or-die regional qualifiers between Glen Burn and Deluxe Burlington. DLB driving with McKenzie Wrist, getting a pass to Brooklyn Benno for the lay-in. Then Glen Burn's McKenna Rowland would juggle in the pass, but end up getting the lay-in as well inside. But it's Glen Burn, Glen Burn who lives to play another day with a 51-40 win. Surrey and Bishop Ryan, also Bishop Ryan getting a win there. Some other region qualifying results in District 10. Garrison moves on with a win over Washburn. Wilton Wing, the top seed, edges out Turtle Lake, surviving there, moving on to Region 5. To District 11, where Botno can celebrate. They move on to the regionals with a win, and also going to Region 6 with them, West Hope Newburn. With a win in District 15, Newtown with the win and partial takes down Willis and Trinity. And finally, in District 16, it's Powers Lake and Tioga that are moving on to Region 8 tournament.